Good morning. Happy Friday. It is also my 23rd birthday. I am no longer 22. I'm currently getting ready to go take some couple photos with my husband. Um, we're meeting my childhood friend. He's a photographer at Redcliffe at 1030. A couple session with him. He was promoting his photography business. Shout out. I have to do it today specifically so Brandon could not complain. Special and I'm really excited to get them done. And after that, we're gonna go lunch. Go to lunch at Red Robins because I've never eaten there before. Just try something new and different. That, I'm not sure if we're gonna come back here or we might go see a movie. It just depends on how we're feeling. I have a family dinner at my parents' house, which I haven't had in a long time, and that's really what I wanted. So that is our plans for today. Tomorrow our windows are getting put in. and It's my birthday weekend. It's very chill, very low key. We have a lot of financial stuff going on and a lot of stuff going on in general. So I just didn't, I wanted to, I didn't want to do too much. Right now Brandon is, it should be on his way home. Hey, shift last night. So he should be home within the next 20 minutes maybe. And um, once we're done getting ready, we'll head out for those pictures. So I will catch up with you guys later, but I'm gonna try and take you guys along um, for my birthday weekend because I usually always document it. So, yeah. Good, Brandon just got home. He brought me home some flowers. Some purple flowers. He got me a new charm for my bracelet and a card, which he didn't write on the thing, but a card. That was super, super sweet. That's the shower running. He's uh, about to get in that, but he went to go feed the cats because they started eating my flowers. I'm all beautified, got my makeup done, although you can still see the zit that I have right there, unfortunately, um, in a dress that my friend let me borrow because I had a specific look that I was going for for these photos. Obviously, I wish this dress was a different color. It fits me the way I wanted it to, and um, it's the length that I wanted, so perfect, but we stopped at McDonald's to get me something to eat because I really needed something sustainable in my stomach. I don't have anything at our house at the moment. You wouldn't have to cook, so he stopped to get me a biscuit, and then we're going to head to Redcliffe. Um, we're probably going to be a few minutes late because of traffic, but whatever. Um, and I'm really excited. These photos done. I'm really excited to get to see my friend that I haven't seen in a long while. I will catch up with you guys when we get there, but um, this girl needs to eat. So this is where I live. You know, okay, fancy. you don't live here. Well, it's really pretty here. I plant some flowers, you know. They come back every day. Yes. Yeah. Step on it. No, I should know. <laughs> Just finished with the photos. I've never been here, so I wanted to look around. He's ready to want to eat, but it's finally warmer than uh, colder. That's nice. So it is 5.30 and Brandon and I just woke up from like a four and a half hour nap um, a few minutes ago and I got ready to like brush my hair, re-put eyeliner on because I don't have any makeup wipes so I had to fix my face because I looked precious, put some pants on and we're about to head to my parents' house for um, family birthday dinner for me. Um, this has been the most low-key birthday I've ever had in my entire life. We went into pictures, ate lunch like a huge lunch, came home and took a four hour nap. I've done anything today, you can definitely tell I'm getting freaking old, um, which is just so weird that I'm 23 and I'm headed to my mid 20s instead of my early 20s now. So it's just weird, but I want to show you guys something that came in this morning as an Amazon box and Brandon and I were heading out to go take our pictures this morning and he comes back inside and goes, every single time I go outside, there's a freaking Amazon box. I'm like, I didn't order anything. He was like, but it has your name on it. I was like, okay. So I went and opened it. And the first thing I saw was this because it said gift. So 
I opened it and I saw who it was from. And my sister got me two gifts. One that I didn't know about, which was this one. And it came in a pretty purple bag with a note. And then it's a Buffy book, which I didn't even know existed. But this is the first thing I saw and that's how I knew that it was Buffy. It was weird. I was wearing a Buffy shirt yesterday. But I felt really sweet. She, I told her to get me a Baymax bobblehead because she has a Baymax bobblehead in her car that I was playing with in a few videos back whenever I went to go visit her for so like a girls trip thing at her school. And she, I told her, I was like, that's what I want. I want one of those. She went in my car. So she ordered me one, but it wasn't going to come in on time. So she, um, I guess, ordered me this too. It's really sweet. She wasn't able to come home this weekend because she has to work in Statesboro, unfortunately. So I'm not going to see her today, but we've been texting back and forth. That was a nice little surprise that I got this morning right as we were walking out the door, literally. He was like, come on, we're going to be late, which we were late because we got stopped by a lot of master's traffic, which we weren't considering, which is really dumb of us. And we got stopped by a train. But anyway, I'm going to head out before Brandon starts yelling at me. Oh my God, did she tear up? She tore up a box of alcohol. Seltzer. She tore up a seltzer box. <laughs> Ellie. <laughs> Ellie, come on. Come on. Go get in your crate. Go get in your crate. She actually listens, y'all. She's being, she's been trained. Girl, good girl, good job, good job, baby. <sighs> All right, let's go eat some yummy dinner. I have been craving my grandmother's potato salad for freaking ever, um, and I finally get it. So I'm going. We're doing. We're cooking out, um, and I'm just really happy to see my family. I've been craving family. I don't know why lately. Like I've been really, really wanting to go on a family vacation. Um, like an actually like with my, my family or Brandon's family. Cause we were thinking about doing that for his birthday, going to Gatlinburg, like on this huge family trip. I really, really want to have been craving just a family vacation because me and him have gone on a lot of couple vacations since we've gone together and we're our own little family, but still that's what I want. So they're moving really fast. This window that's supposed to be in the guest room, the two that are together that are supposed to slide in broke on the truck. So they're gonna have to come and install that one at a later date. Um, at least we don't have to pay until installation is complete. So whenever this window gets installed is when our payments will start. Ellie's not happy she's trapped in her cage, but hopefully they'll get through this pretty fast. And we've already done two windows. Um, and obviously they can't do this one, so, and there's like six guys, so hopefully it'll go by pretty fast. I think this window is the window I am most excited about <laughs> getting switched out because it is going to be a beautiful bay window. These are the windows. They haven't, um, sealed them or anything yet or put the stuff around it. But they're a lot thicker than the other ones, so we've lost a lot of window seal space. But I'm really excited for them to take the plastic off and get it fit. We're so close, they're doing the downstairs. There's now the warmest room in our house, our freaking bathroom, because we keep the door closed for the cat. We cannot find Anastasia anywhere. Shadow in there because we're not doing this. The window broke. But it's freezing in our living room because I just took down the windows in our living room. There they are. You 
empty. Uh, what are we doing? Heating the outside? I need to go turn the heater off. <laughs> yeah, you do. <laughs> So I thought I hit thunder. It's Sunday. I did not finish longing yesterday. Uh, people doing the windows. Honestly, just got really tired and I completely forgot about it. I wound up going, well, they wound up leaving at 4.30. Oh, uh, got everything done. Excuse me. But the window in the guest bedroom, they're pretty tinted outside. So uh, from a distance, you cannot really see inside of our house. Now, if you get up closer to the windows, you can see inside them. But that's nice. To me, Brandon and his best friend went to CeCe's Pizza last night. A fade dinner. And then um, we went to Walmart to get some blackout shades for our bedroom, which is what I've been wanting forever, which is why it's so dark in here. So you guys you can pull the handle down with this and it's attached up there so we couldn't put anything in the window seal anymore like our old like blinds used to be because those are thick so nothing will fit in the window seal anymore like our cats don't even have a place to lay down up here but they go all the way up like that like an accordion and then you can pull them down that makes me so freaking happy I am really enjoying this. Um, I was supposed to get up and go to church this morning with Deanna. Um, they had a really early service because of the masters. But honestly, we went to bed later than we planned on it. And um, I didn't feel good throughout the night. My stomach was hurting pretty bad. So I am um, going this morning. But found out that her sister-in-law is finally in labor and she's going to have her baby girl today. So that's really exciting. I'm going to go downstairs and find me some breakfast to eat. I guess just relax on the, account, on the couch. We have had a lot going on this weekend, so I'm probably not going to do much today. I'm going to take Brandon his belt to work because he forgot it. I want a milkshake, so I dreamt about a milkshake and now I really want one. So I'm probably going to wind up go getting me one sometime after lunch. Is just my plan it's gonna be a low-key day so hey guys all day no see i haven't recorded anything because i haven't done anything i literally got up made myself something to eat and laid on the couch for the rest of the afternoon before i got up around 2 30 and i left the house and went uh to drop brandon's belt off to him at the fire station and I went and got me some lunch and Ellie came with me because she had to spend half of her day in the cage yesterday because all of the um, window people were here working. Walk and I was gonna record some of that but I was on the phone with my cousin the entire time and then for the past hour being back at the house so I didn't get a chance to record anything. I wanna show you guys a couple of windows in my kitchen. I'm doing is taking a shower and then laying on the couch for the rest of the night and then get ready for work tomorrow. This is our huge bay window in our kitchen. I'm really upset because they put the curtains back up, so you can't really get the full effect. But it's two smaller windows on either side, and then one huge big window in the middle. Let's see if I can back the camera out there. You can get a better view. This side and this side to the middle, and you can open those so they roll into each other, so it's sliding. And I love it because the kitchen so much more open. It makes it look bigger and much brighter. And this is a bay window. I didn't want to put shades or blinds or curtains or anything on it. So we're probably gonna, I'm probably gonna have Brandon take these down because I didn't want these back up in the first place. This is our awning. This is what they call it. We have one in our upstairs, but you can't see through it. It's like a rain effect. That's what it's called. It doesn't open all the way. It's like one of the, it comes out at an angle. So I'm gonna unlock it for you guys. And you do this, you twist it, and the window comes out, and then there's my cat. And there's a screen, and you can pop the screens off with these, but obviously with those animals, you don't want to do that. But that's how that window goes. And then you just swivel it back in, 
and put the lock in and then lock the windows and who not my breath. Voila, that's it. So those are our fancy new windows. We don't have any grills or grids all in them. Um, there's some more in our dining room. They look really nice. They're tinted on the outside. So you can't really see into the house unless you're up. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to be doing, I'm going to write a blog on it and do before and after pictures and stuff like that on there. And go into detail about the cost and what we did and all that good stuff with a house update thing for that. But I hope you guys had a great weekend. I hope you guys have a good week ahead. And I'm going to relax on the couch and then go take a shower and get ready for work tomorrow.